So welcome again to our video lesson in mathematics. So our topic for today is on adding and subtracting dissimilar fractions. Dissimilar fractions are fractions with different denominators or unlike denominators. So methods in adding or subtracting dissimilar fractions. Find the LCD or least common denominator of the two fractions being added or subtracted. Then after the LCD is determined, divide the LCD by the denominator of the first fraction, then multiply the numerator to the results, then write your answer. Follow the same step in second fraction. Add or subtract the numerators of the two fractions, then copy the denominator. Then, simplify the results if needed. So let's have first adding the similar fractions. So, let's have the following examples. Number 1. So, 3 plus 1 fifth. So, the solution for this is we need to find the LCD. But first, we need to add or give the denominator of 3 which is equal to 1. So, so the LCD is equal to 5. And then, after determining the LCD, so we divide 5 divided by 1, the result is 5. And then we multiply 5 to the numerator which is equal to 3. So that results to 15. Then copy the operation which is add and then 5 divided by 5 that is equal to 1. And then 1 times 1, that is equal to 1. And then, we add 15 plus 1, which gives us the answer of 16. And then, we copy the denominator that is equal to 5. The answer is 16 over 5 or, in simplified form, the answer is 3 and 1 fifth. Next example. So we proceed on example number 2. So 4 plus 2 thirds. So what is the answer? First step is we find the LCD of the two fractions and we added 1 as the denominator for 4. So the LCD is equal to 3. So, 3 divided by 1, that is equal to 3. And then, we multiply the numerator, which is 4. So, 3 times 4, it gives us the answer of 12. Copy again the operation, the addition. And then, 3 divided by 3, that is equal to 1. And then, 1 times 2, that is equal to 2. We add 12 plus 2, that is equal to 14. And then, we copy the denominator, that is equal to 3. We simplify again our answer, and it gives us the answer of 4 and 2 thirds. Next number. So, number 3, examples. So, we add again a numerator for 5, which is equal to 1. And then, we find the LCD of the two fractions. The LCD is 6. So, 6 divided by 1, that is equal to 6, multiplied by 5. 
to the numerator. So, 6 times 5, that is equal to 30. Plus, so, 6 divided by 6, that is equal to 1, times 1. So, we add 1. The answer is 30 plus 1, that is equal to 31. All over, you copy the denominator, that is equal to 6. Or, in simplified form, the, ad the answer is 5 and 1 over 6. So let's have another example, number 4. 1 half plus 1 third. So, this time, still, we are going to find the LCD of the two fractions. So, that gives us 6. So, let's think of a number that is, it can be divided by 2 and can be divided by 3. So, it gives us 6. So, 6 divided by 2, that is 3, multiplied by 1, it gives us 3. Plus, 6 divided by 3. The result is equal to 2. And then, you multiply to the numerator 1. So, 2 times 1, that is equal to 2. And then, you add 3 plus 2, that is equal to 5. Then, copy the denominator, which is 6. So, your final answer is 5 over 6. Next, number 5, 1 8 plus 2 3rd. So again, you find the LCD of 8 and 3. What number is the LCD of 8 and 3? So that is 24. So 24 divided by 8, the result is 3. Then we multiply 3 to the numerator times 1. So 3 times 1, it gives us the answer of 3 plus 24 divided by 3. The answer is 8. And then 8, we multiply to the numerator that is equal to 2. So 8 times 2, that is 16. Then the final answer is 3 plus 16. It gives us the answer of 19. Then copy the denominator which is equal to 24. So your final answer is... 1 8 plus 2 third is equal to 19 over 24. Next, 1 over 7 plus 1 over 5. The LCD for 7 and 5 is 35. So 35 divided by 7, it gives us the answer of 5. And then, 5 times 1, it gives us the answer of 5 plus 35 divided by 5, that is equal to 7. And then, we multiply 1. So, 7 times 1, that is equal to 7. Then, we add 5 plus 7. So, 12 divided by 35. So here are the other examples in finding the sum of dissimilar fractions.